Uh, there's no such thing as an essential carbohydrate. Not one zero gram of carbohydrate is required. Uh, I wrote in a Substack this week that went out and it looked at all the reports, 1999 report, IDE, CG, working group, it categorically said the theoretical minimal level of carbohydrate intake is zero. And uh, I just went through all the reports. So, you know, we had one in 2005 as well, which was the panel on macronutrients of the National Academies of Sciences. And they actually said the lower limit of dietary carbohydrate compatible with life apparently is zero, provided that adequate amounts of protein and fat are consumed. And that substack went on and on with all the different people telling you that just protein and fat is fine. So uh, that's my answer. But I'm sure Richard will uh, jump in with uh, more than two penneth worth. Uh, <laughs> Look, yeah, it, it, yeah it, in essence, you are absolutely correct. The, the, we don't need any carbohydrate. Um, fatty meat, uh, you know, uh, only eat ground chuck. Chuck is my favorite, both ground and in um, steak format. Look, most people can thrive on this. The body needs protein. The body needs fat. If we look at every cell within the body, the body predominates water. If we remove the water, what's left is protein and fat. With, with sugar or polysaccharide only making 1% to 2% of the weight of that cell, which basically means that the body, including your bone and muscle, is made of protein and fat. The body makes all of the glucose that it needs through a process called gluconeogenesis. Um, there are situations in which this pathway can become damaged, but that's a talk for another day. 